It is a collection of knowledge, understanding, beliefs, philosophy, and skills of indigenous peoples and local communities that have been accumulated and passed on for a long time. It is the knowledge that comes from observation and hands-on activities in daily practices through interactions between human and local ecosystems. Indigenous and local knowledge has gained serious attention from academics only recently, around 40 to 50 years ago. Although this knowledge has been an important part of the livelihoods of indigenous peoples and local communities all along. There are three groups of Taolay in Thailand, namely the Mokan, the Moklen, and the Uruk Lawai. In the past, they had an autonomous lifestyle with frequent movement around the islands and coastal areas. In the dry season, the Mokan spend their lives sailing and finding subsistence through hunting gathering with traditional methods. They also hunt and gather for trade. The Uruk Lawai also go out to sea to hunt and gather marine animals, such as sea cucumbers, that they dry to trade for necessities. The Moklan are coastal people who gather along the beach in mangrove areas, and they are also familiar with inland livelihoods, such as growing wild rice and gardening near their homes. Each group of sea people is familiar with eco-niches of both coastal and island areas. They have knowledge of seasonal change and the nature of waves, wind and rain, including the behaviors and habitats of various animals, especially the ones that they depend on for food, together with plants and animals found in the forest, on the beaches and in the mangrove forests. Chao Lei also have knowledge and skills to develop technology that have been passed on as cultural heritage and have enabled them to live sustainably for hundreds of years. The Mokan and Uruk Lawai are marine divers, doing both free diving and hookah or air pump diving. Therefore, they are able to observe the changes in the sea, such as the occurrence of cold water masses and currents in the fishing area that cause behavior change of marine animals or cause the reduction or the disappearance of different species. Chao Lei also noticed changes in coral reef, especially coral bleaching. The Moken, the Uruk Lawai, and the Moklen are coastal and island hunter-gatherers who are familiar with the area and are able to observe the state of flora and fauna that have changed. This will provide important information that will help in assessing the status of the ecosystem and biodiversity of marine and coastal areas.